Hey YouTube, Mochismo Eugene, another video from Exit Strategy. Uh, I just wanted to remind everyone of something that <clears throat> Chosen One and Empaths specifically that you probably already surmised as the holiday season is approaching, which is uh, the next holiday is Christmas. I don't want you guys to not make plans because plans are a beautiful thing. You have to plan. And if you don't plan uh, in life, you, you don't really have a true sense of where you're going. Uh, even the, the good book says, he who builds a house without counting the cost as a fool. So in making those plans, one thing I just wanna encourage you guys to do, don't tell the narcissist what you're doing. They ask you for, uh, Details on what you're doing for the holidays. Just tell them nothing. Or you could just tell them, not sure. I wouldn't say nothing because you'll leave that door open. Because what you have to understand, the narcissist is already making plans to suck you dry of your energy. And the fuel that you afford them. They've already made their list and checking it twice. <laughs> they are ready and uh, they're just ready, man. You know, they get excited. <laughs> they get excited for these holidays. I'm just chuckling because, <laughs> man. <laughs> Oh man, they don't, they don't miss a beat. They don't miss a beat. They capitalize on every opportunity to uh, come in, man, and just try to be the reason for the season. <laughs> And unfortunately, they are, they are effective because when you're awoke from the state that we were in and deceived and under this kind of a spell of this hocus pocus, what the narcissist put on us, we somehow believe that they were <clears throat> true leaders of something that was going somewhere. They come in with what we perceive to be good ideas, good suggestions, just, you know, just natural born leaders. But what we don't realize is they've just left another supply and they've siphoned and stolen the very ideas that that uh, uh, supply gave them and they've recycled it to you, making it appear like there was some grand idea that they came up with. And the funny thing is they don't retain a lot of the information they get from people who are healthy, who are empaths, who have just organic ideas. Reason being that they have so much going on in their database because the average human being, we only use a certain small percentage of our brain, scientifically or biologically speaking. Now, once we get so much information in our head, as healthy people or as the average human being, we take in a certain amount of energy, uh, information and we somehow not forget. Well, in, mo in a lot of cases, we might not even remember something for the rest of our life if we don't encounter someone or some kind of instance where it gives us a total recall. And I guess my bigger point is you got to understand that's just the normal average person we can't retain, but so much information like a computer for say, our brains are like a computer input output. So think about and compound that times 10. This is what the narcissist is doing. They are not retaining anything for even um, 
an average amount of time. Fuel in, fuel out, fuel in, fuel out. It's almost like they're NASCAR drivers. <laughs> you know NASCAR, when they drive around, they use a lot of fuel up. They have to make a lot of pit stops. That's why. Because they're driving a thousand miles an hour. That's what the nurses are doing. They're driving you crazy. They're driving other suppliers crazy. Everything they're doing is on a rat race. You know they can't be still. You know they can't regulate themselves, their emotions. They're fidgety. And so as this holiday season approaches, I just wanted to encourage you guys, man. Uh, even, even just anybody who asked you what you're doing, even though you have plans in your mind and in your heart you want to do something special for someone maybe for the holiday. And if you're like me, it's nothing really major you want to do <clears throat> besides keep your health and your strength and your faith close to heart and, uh, and your family. Keep them close to heart. My children, my twins, for example, they are, they, they will be 14 on the 28th of December. So I'm excited about that because they're already teenagers, but this will be the second year of their teen years. And, uh, just watching them grow up is a very beautiful thing. They're very intelligent and uh, the joy of my life. So uh, keep the sacred things sacred. Don't divulge and don't run about around flamboyantly telling anybody or most people what your plans are. Don't go skipping around uh, with the festive holiday joy season because if the narcissist detects that you're in that holiday season best believe they are already contemplate how contemplating how they're going to destroy that moment for you so um, keep that in mind and you know I did a video about a month ago about a uh, narcissist pastor I'm still awaiting someone to drop the name of this pastor that I was referring to in the video and this is not a smear of sorts. I just want to reward anyone who has a clear idea of who this individual is. And it would show me that you're paying attention of these to these things that are going on right up on our nose. Uh, every man that says he's a man of God and, you know, just the, the frivolous stuff that this individual is doing, awakened ones would see it. We will see it. And again, I told you, I really love this individual's voice. Uh, you know, it's a gift. I mean, I, I used to endorse this guy like you wouldn't believe. And that was when I was asleep. And now I know about narcissistic personality disorder. They come in all type of forms. They can be pastors, they can be doctors, lawyers, cops, uh, judges, commissioners, governors presidents of the United States in foreign countries. We all know too well, these people can be anybody, but they're only certain people. And we know this, we can identify. So first person uh, drops that name and I check uh, in the comments, I had already uh, agreed or I had proposed uh, to send $25 through their cash app as just a compensation for your diligence and paying attention. That being said, guys, good night, bless.